Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, your time. Welcome to News in Details TV. Welcome our new members to the old ones. We love you guys. As you're supporting us, may the Lord support you in everything you lay your hands. Amen. To the news in details. Guys, please hit that red button that says subscribe. The bell that says all the SS you get to know when we upload new video. Happy new month to everybody. And may your deepest prayers be answered. Okay, so we have been following the news and we know that um, um, Jacoban of Lagos has been announced as the incoming president. But there is a twist to it yet. Peter Obi is not backing out either. So the news reads, our vice presidential candidate, Dr. Yusuf Baba Ahmed, is addressing an international press conference at the Labour Party headquarters in Abuja. I intend to address Nigerians and the international community shortly. These were the words of Peter Obi. And yes, the vice, his vice, addressed, um, had a press conference today where he talked, um, where he gave his speech, saying that Obi would also address them shortly. Now, a lot of Nigerians, you know, are not still taking it lying down. And remember that Obi said in his own words that everybody should be calm but persistent. Now we are understanding more what he's saying. I want us to quickly take some comments and see the reactions of Nigerians. Somebody says that's our president calm and devoted. Anything you ask of us, we will do, sir. So you see, Nigerians are already listening. My president will address Nigerians soon. We are solidly behind you, somebody says. Anybody who will celebrate this election as a successful and transparent election will lost the most precious thing to injustice and the fraudulent way God of justice will visit INEC chairman and Buhari and APC cohorts, somebody said. Another person says, we all know the truth. We know that you are our president, but the election was rigged. We are patiently waiting to hear from you. Somebody says, whatever happened in this election, everyone has learned his or her lesson. The only problem is to defeat an incumbent government is in alliance with what happened today. Winning election is all about strategy, unity, and having the right personality on the pilot. Obi is the new sheriff in town, but all his votes were given to somebody else. God is watching, somebody says. Anyone who is celebrating this election, anyone who is celebrating this election wants to suffer again we all saw what happened we are watching and we are calm as you said guys we have a lot of comments here i want us to know that if obi and his vice do not rather did not win this election, I do not think they will want to go to court. Let us be specific here. They would not want to go to court. But this one, it is crystal clear that they won the election. And it was like, it was taken away from them. Nigerians came, they came in their mass, and they voted. And remember, what these people want, which is the Nigerians, is better life. They want to make sure they have a secured future. They want to make sure they have a country they could call their own. That is why they came out in their mass. They want to make sure when they are done from school, they get a job. 
They want to make sure when they go to school, they spend the accurate time in school. This is why they came out in their master vote. And so now I not telling them indirectly that their vote does not count. It becomes the problem. Nobody is happy. This is the first time I see a presidential candidate being announced. And it's like the world is mourning. That is just the truth. So, people are patiently good morning, waiting. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, your time. To hear Welcome to News on Twitter. Welcome to Twitter. Welcome to the old ones. We love and I do not know As if some of us have stumbled on the video that, that is making the news in um, Guys, it don't write. Headline in the internet. Breaking news of the century. Where he talked about when he the won INF the presidential Oh my goodness, and now the Jagaban of Lagos Bola Ahmed um, candidate as, um, the governorship as the president in, um, of Nigeria. In Anambra State. He has been certified and that he has met all the requirements and Nigerians have voted him in. And they got it back. We do not understand. How? After six months we in saw the office, what happened. he was impeached. Honestly. He said again he went to The court. world is watching what they gave back to him. How After violent the election year, was. Another election How took place. rigging is taking place. And and all of a sudden, he's it telling us, no wonder he said, he went to court again if you for followed the me earlier, time, that if I you have any very problem, carefully. you should come and, and say it. it Guys, I want him. us to hear it from his mouth. And Please spend watch. Hey, Professor Mahmoud Yakubu. And hereby certify so, that the I am remains, the returning officer for the Nigerians 2023 presidential election. Say. That is the held on the 25th of they February they voted for. 2023. Because remember, the election that was contested. The um, President Buhari the said that this election the is going to be free and fair. That is what he said. It's going to be Irene free Christopher and fair. Of a party. It was neither free. It was neither free. It was neither free itself. A lot Al of the videos Hamza are facing online. I would have played it here. But, party. you know, 14, it's, it's going to be against the law of YouTube because of Omoye what happened Stephen in the video. Of the AAC. So guys, my children are watching. They knew what happened. And eight votes. But their hopes Sani Yabagi Yusuf so that is of the ADP. So guys, thank you for your maximum support here. Please join us if you haven't. Click on the red button that says subscribe. Kachuku and Dumebi click on the bell that says all. Oh, you get to know what we're Please share us H1, out and also like the video. Thank you guys. And 